Well, it's a beautiful afternoon across mid-Missouri. Lots of sunshine to go around. Crystal clear blue sky temperatures anywhere between about 60 to even 70 degrees across portions of the area. If you can get out and enjoy it, of course, practicing social distancing, I would suggest you do so. We're going to be tracking some rainfall chances that are going to be turning this kind of forecast into a rainier one as we're headed throughout the end of this week. Clouds building into the area late, that's going to be uh, addressing that rainfall chance beginning to develop as we're headed into the early morning hours tomorrow. Should wake up to a good bit of cloud cover as well. Uh, likely not going to be seeing much in the way of sunshine tomorrow. And then those rain shower chances will gradually begin to build as we're headed throughout the early afternoon and throughout the evening hours across the area. Future Track, I think, does a pretty good job in picking up what we're going to be expecting. By the time we get to the early morning hours, may start to see a few showers break out across uh, Benton County up north towards Sedalia through the I-65 corridor, or Highway 65 corridor, that's not an interstate. Continuing to track it and move throughout the area throughout the afternoon hours. Again, some steady rainfall possible, especially with these yellow bands that begin to pop up across the region. And that storm system in general moves through fairly quickly, but it will be a pretty nice window of maybe six to seven hours worth of uh, steady rainfall. So it will add up to maybe half to three quarters of an inch area wide. And then another chance of rain develops as we're headed into Friday. That's as our next storm system rolls through. Looks like though as we head into the weekend, those rain chances will begin to diminish as we start to kick some of these storm systems out. So uh, the big weather days we're going to be tracking Wednesday and Friday. May even see a couple rumbles of thunder throughout the day on Friday as that next storm system passes through. And if you're looking for a quick start to summer, I'm not really seeing much indication of that. This sort of dry and cool atmosphere that we've been dealing with outside of these rain chances looks like it will prevail throughout much of next week.